Hi, today we're going to take you through how to enable remote access to your Home Assistant instance. There is some useful information on the Home Assistant page for securing your Home Assistant instance before enabling remote access. Remote access is required if you wish to access Home Assistant when you're not connected to your local network or if you wish to enable integration with a smart speaker. First of all, you will need to install the Duck DNS add-on with Let's Encrypt support. This is to enable a valid SSL certificate and obtain a domain name for your encrypted traffic. From within Home Assistant, you will need to go to the Hasire page on the left hand side, click on the add-on store and find DuckDNS and then click on install. After the install is completed, click through to the DuckDNS page and generate a token after you've selected a domain name of your choice. You will need to copy the token that's been generated and then paste this into the configuration within Home Assistant. You'll also need to add in the new domain name, for example, hasio.duckdns.org, and then change the accept terms to true. Once this has been completed, click save. You'll now need to update your configuration.yaml file. Uncomment the HTTP section and update the base URL to your new domain that you've selected. For example, hasio.duckdns.org port 8123. Add in the SSL certificate and the SSL key configurations. And then once complete, save the file. You can refer to my post for detailed configuration examples. You'll also need to forward port 8123 for TCP traffic on your router to the HASIO IP address. If you haven't already selected a static IP address, refer to my earlier videos during the initial setup to see how you can configure the network using a USB memory stick. After this has been completed, restart your Home Assistant instance and then log in to the new domain address. You'll need to enter in your username and password. After this has been completed, you should now be able to access your Home Assistant remotely. This means you can now use the Home Assistant app on your phone and control your device from outside of your house. Check out my detailed post in the video description for configurations used and my other videos, including how to enable Google Home integration. Thanks for watching.